What? What? What is this? No, I don't. I don't do anything. No, don't look at it. Don't look at it. Hello viewers, this is Soma part 11. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Well, that was a dumb move. Let's see. Okay. Okay, elevator. We got an elevator over here. Are we done here? Yeah. <laughs> Activate the clown, please. Sure thing. There's only one of you. Only one of you. It's dumb luck, right? I woke up in the right body. I basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right Simon. Christ. <laughs> this is awful. We did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind. Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Let me say something. I don't want to think. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I could still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist's brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the Ark, would it be any different? I'd still be alone. No friends. No family. You could make new friends? I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. If not, you still have. I knew it. 
I knew it. Catherine? Kath? Hello, Catherine. What Hello. happened? Give me my two back. Give me my two, please. Oh, no way. What is going on here? Jellyfishes. Wow. Wow. Jellyfishes everywhere. So colorful. Trap? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. The power blacked out for a moment. Think it could be the atmospheric pressure. It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry, it should hold. Comforting. It will hold. Does, does time freeze when you're not powered? Time feels omitted more than anything. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back or hindered. And I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes. But generally you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural continuation since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. My experience is more like an ever-changing moment that never really seems to find closure. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. It's rough. Could be worse. Could be a time traveler stuck in a body made from black goo. That'd be the worst. Imagine, I don't know. I just, I'll just pull out my uh, circuitry. Look, let's go. Ah, what? What? What is this? No, I don't. I don't do anything. No, don't look at it. Don't look at it. Thank you for my two. So blurry, man. Why?
Daddy fish. I don't like this. I don't like this. If you have a fear of the deep ocean, don't play this game. Okay? I'm warning you now. Don't play this game. Stay close to the lights. Blue leads to the towel. Red leads to the climber. Mutated monster thing. Let's run. Let's run. Let's run. This is now current. Let's run. of target unknown for a serious creature disfigured by gel or manic and will attack anything still hard to determine how wow has affected their behavior beyond the apparent aggression and affinity for light the creature seemed to to hurt something particular something not present in the ecosystem all right so not using any light anymore. Oh, we have to try. Oh, the lights off though. Dude, I got no idea where I'm supposed to go.
Blue lights go to town. But why are these lights off now? They were on. The current is strong, fighting, blurry, can't see nothing. I feel like there's something gonna chase me now. We can control. I don't like the fact that my back's to it.
Well, I assume I follow it. Just hope uh, it doesn't get munched on. Go away, stupid man. Huh? This way? Into the creepy cave we go. Yeah! Ah, oh, no, that freaks me out. Damn, look at this. It's a sea spider. A sea spider. Man, that's creepy. How long does does these glow lights last though? <laughs> I mean when was the last time they uh, someone was down yet? I mean the bodies are green. Uh, how far is this place? Ah! <laughs> ugly fish! Get, leave me alone! Man that thing's ugly! Yeah, go away, fish. Go away. You're not scary. You're just ugly. Man, how do we? How, how are they winds in the water? Okay, okay, this seems promising. Finally, can I get some of my vision back though? Blurry. It. The 
Let's continue. Station. No, where am I? Omicron, Climber Station, Observatory. I went through here, now I'm here. I'm a town. Failed evac story circulating at Omicron. Oh, God. Listen, son. We're on an important mission, and we need your help to operate the Omega space gun. When it's done, we can all head back up the plateau. But now we need to get moving. Of course. Head on through to the habitat. We shut off the front section to preserve power. All right. See you soon. Okay, I'm here. That door's open, open, laboratories. Something going on over there. That seems like an important door. That's the end of the video. Goodbye.